Take our lead. Let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. Let me show you step by step how to do it. Step 1. Lay meat on a cutting board. Step 2. Sprinkle meat with a little bit of all-purpose flour and a dash of salt and pepper. Step 3. Pound each piece of steak with a large knife. Step 4. Flip the meat over and repeat steps 1 to 3 on the other side. Take our lead. You can use cube steak exactly as you would use round steak or stew beef, slowly simmering it to tenderness in flavorful soups, stews and slow-cooked meals. But because cube steak has been tenderized and flattened, it's also commonly pan-fried on the stove. Make your mark, take our lead. The term cube steak refers to a cut of meat that has been run through a mechanical tenderizer, called a meat cuber or swissing machine. The resulting steak is called a cube steak, or Swiss steak, because of the cube-shaped indentations made by the tenderizer. Make your mark, take our lead! One common mistake that consumers make in the kitchen is washing or rinsing their meat or poultry before cooking it. However, washing raw poultry, beef, pork, lamb or veal before cooking it is not recommended. Bacteria in raw meat and poultry juices can be spread to other foods, utensils and surfaces. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.